Let me show you something, doggy dog. Okay, let me show you something. Let me show you something, okay? Yeah. Watch, watch this. Watch this, watch this. Watch this, okay? Watch dog. Dog, dog. Okay, see? All right, all right. Rumors say in 2020 or 2021, Gigi Brown is setting up to go to Modern Day High School. She's going to play lacrosse and basketball, except I didn't know she was going to play lacrosse. I was the only Brown coach in Orange County, California, who didn't know that Gigi Bryant was going to play lacrosse at Modern Day High School. But because I'm Brown, not racist, she would have made a huge impact on the world if she played lacrosse at Modern Day High School as a JV girls lacrosse player with the one brown coach in the world who was linking USC, Modern Day, the Prietos, the Mendozas, and the Diomsais. Guys, rumors. Those rumors came to me from Demetrio Fernandez's wife, the dentist's wife. They're a Santa Margarita Catholic High School family. They scammed my teeth of so many cavities that I did not have. And after COVID, they begged me to come back. Santa Margarita High School, I think you're full of people just like them. I think that you had either Lonzo or LaVar or whatever, Lamar Ball, plotting about Gigi Bryant from the inside of the Lakers. And we all know that LeBron James needed to be alpha dog. He just needed it. He needed it. All right? Gigi Bryant could have played lacrosse at Modern Day. She wasn't going to play lacrosse at Santa Margarita, though, was she? Because over here is Holly Riley and Glenn Miles. The people at Modern Day attached to Johnny Rodriguez, including his fucking wife, Christina, hated them. I loved them. That's why I was such a good coach. Influence came from Glenn Miles and Holly Riley to Modern Day High School through me, and it created such a good place to learn lacrosse that they were thinking about putting Gigi Bryant there. What did Christina and Johnny do? They chased Glenn Miles and Holly Riley out of Orange County, California. They did it by starting a rumor that Holly Riley cheated on her Navy SEAL husband with Glenn Miles to birth a baby that that Navy SEAL did not father. And that Navy SEAL had to go to her championship game carrying her baby to just say, those rumors are wrong. That's Santa Margarita right here, guys. I mean, St. Margaret's right here. Santa Margarita over here has Sean James Coe in the mix and he is a human trafficker of all sorts and kinds. I don't care if he blames his mother for everything. He is the facilitator with a dick and he's employed right there with a third party between three Trinity League schools. One of them's full of scandal, but it was able to contain it. I mean, they even fired Jerry Campo. The Diocese of Baltimore is definitely involved, but Baltimore things do not take root in Orange County, California, as well as a bunch of fucking Filipino evangelical Baptists do. I mean, they started across the street on Occidental in Santa Ana, California, right around the same time that Bruce Rollinson raped the stat girl. Okay, modern day, hey? You could have had Gigi Bryant. You could have had Michelle Deontay Mendoza on varsity, but Chloe Silence, knowing uh, the ins and outs of strategy, she didn't need me on varsity. She needed me on JV, which is fine. Santa Margarita, Saint, I mean St. Margaret's, with Holly Riley and Glenn Miles would have been a nice counterweight 
against modern day high school because the competition right here which was on display between modern day girls lacrosse and Santa, St. Margaret's girls lacrosse for a couple of years was such good lacrosse that it sent multiple really talented girls to Division I NCAA lacrosse. And it was so balanced that somebody over at Foothill fucking high school had to make sure everyone was gone. And how? It's by whatever she fed Jerry Campo to pull her husband's fucking dick. Today, all of this scandal looks really bad for Modern Day High School, Foothill High School, Christina Nicole Johnson, Johnny Rodriguez, Michelle Deonta Mendoza, et al. Who's sitting at Santa Margarita Catholic High School acting like he isn't a problem? There's a hockey team that practices or plays in Riverside at those rinks. The team name is Sean's Fault. I don't care if you're Irish, you're an American scam and a con man. I have to build up the bravery to put you in jail. At one point I think, I, at one point I thought I loved you because I cared and I thought you were a victim. But the choices you've made to position yourself at Santa Margarita Catholic High School as if you're a fucking celebrity. Looks so fucking pathetic next to what you actually did, what you actually said, what you've posted, and wherever else, all of the pictures that you have harvested from everyone in lacrosse have gone. I think that um, some money that you made in 2023 that does not add up should show up in a few tax returns regarding Whittier College. Because had you listened to me or asked me any questions, you would have known that Whittier College loses to Chapman University every preseason, and you would not have recruited that hard for a dying team. That's a mistake you made without me. I think that you are a fraud. I have to keep coaching myself into believing it because Stockholm Syndrome is real when it comes to Sean James Co. I think his ex tried to kill herself because of it. So if I'm right, I need help.